Taurus. Thank you so much for tuning in. Let's get started. Remember, it's not a personal reading. It's general. Okay, so right away, I'm getting somebody's thinking about you a lot. Let's see, what do we have for Taurus? Um, towards this person, their thoughts. Let's get into their thoughts. Okay. Okay. So somebody here, there could have been a third party situation, but they're having regrets. Um, or there could have been outside influences here that got in the way. And this person is actually regretting. They know that somebody, something here needs to change between you two. Yeah. If you're thinking that there is someone there, there isn't. I feel like there's outside influences that got in the way. Okay. Maybe other people. Gossip. Whatever. Why? Because they are alone right now. They are needing some time alone. Um, but maybe they were talking to others or something as well. So let's see. Give me more on this person's thoughts towards Taurus. And I'll read them right now. Okay. We have the other regrets wear and tear in alone time. So let's see. Give me more for Taurus, this person's thoughts towards them. Can't move on. See? Maybe there was some online dating that was going on here. They, um, so we have the other, the other person I'm seeing is influencing my decision. Maybe they are seeing someone else, but I don't think so. I don't get that. I feel like they're trying to move on. Maybe they're trying to talk to other people or, you know, play the field. We have regrets. I agree. Regret the things I should have done, but never did. Wear and tear. This love is starting to wear on me. Something has to change. Alone time. I'm taking the time to be alone and balance my emotions. Can't move on. I can't move on no matter how hard I've tried. See, they've even gone online dating and they can't. I have a few love interests online. Nothing serious, just casual flirting. I'm telling you. This person try, is trying to move on, but they just can't. So let's see. And that's what other influences are here. Well, let's see. Give me more on this. Um, the other. There's new beginnings here. There's possibilities of new beginnings. Okay, so... Like I said, this person wants to clear the air. I feel like there was other things um, that were influencing this. Uh, there was some kind of ending, of course. But I'm feeling that there were... I feel like there were other people in their ear for some reason. I see three people there too. There was an outside influence that ended things. You didn't know everything. You didn't know everything that there is to know, I feel. So I'm also getting a lot of love. Ten of Cups. Let's see. Give me more on this regrets. Yeah. They want to start all over. They're regretting this ending. Their foolish behavior I'm getting here. They've been thinking a lot about how the way they were acting. The fool, you know, careless, carefree. You know, somebody that jump, jumps over a cliff is careless. I don't care what anybody says. The fool isn't... I, I heard someone and kind of was like, what? This girl? Or <laughs> whatever. The voice doesn't really mean foolish behavior. Yes. With the outside, with the cards around it. Yes, it does. To me, it does. What do you call somebody that's careless? That jumps off a cliff. You know, a dog is trying to, to stop them. You know, without even thinking. Anyways. So... Yeah, with the Fool and the Ten of Swords, somebody here, because of their actions, their careless actions, I feel that they are regretting this ending. We have two Tens. For some of you, there is a 
possibilities of a new beginning. Give me more of this wear and tear. Because I feel like this person will be up for it. Yep. Moving forward, talking, communication. But somebody here, Taurus, I feel like you have taken your energy away. You're also, you're probably keeping tabs, you know, um, getting a lot of readings or maybe watching a lot of readings or you're just, you're kind of, you're moving away, but at the same time, you're still looking back at them to see if they're going to reach out, if they're going to change their mind or something like that. Give me more of this alone time. I think you're waiting for them to, to reach out. With these, this alone time, I feel like they're taking the time right now to figure out how they can move forward, but they keep, they keep coming to how do I say it? They keep thinking about how to mend things with you because they can't really move forward. You see this chariot? They have a snake around and they keep looking back like, no, I can't move forward. I need to mend the situation with them. They're trying to manifest this too. Let's see. Give me more of this can't move on. They're trying to figure out how to come and mend it. Can't move on, see? But this person, Taurus, they can't move on because they see you as somebody that they can have abundance with. Abundance in happiness, long-term relationship, successful relationship. I'm feeling that they um, probably have eyes on you too. Like they, tabs, they're keeping a they're keeping an eye on you to see if maybe you're going to come towards them. I feel like both of you are are waiting to see who's going to come towards who. To tell you the truth, I'm getting that here twice. Um, one is you and the other is them. See, but they have very um hard time thinking about it positive. Like they... They're not, they're thinking very pessimistic about their online dating or maybe dating someone else. They're not, it's really difficult for them to see themselves being in a happy, loving relationship. Maybe they have felt rejection online as well, or they're just not satisfied with whatever is out there on the um, dating pool. Okay, so we have the devil. So there could have been some codependency issues or just a, uh, toxic energy between you two toxic energy somebody here could have been a little too clingy um i'm feeling as well okay for some of you for others there was just a lot of um negativity around you and this connection okay let's get you some advice for taurus advice for taurus and this connection with this person Keep it private. Yes. Please don't put your issues out there. Um, it's, it's probably them though. I don't know why I'm getting them for some of you. Or this is probably not going to resonate. It's probably them because there is outside influence. But we'll see. Maybe a cross watcher. <laughs> if you have issues in your relationship, learn to talk to your partner instead of airing your dirty laundry and risk damaging the future of your relationship. I feel like there was some outside influences here. Okay, so be careful of who you're telling your stuff to. Um, Facebook, don't write it on Facebook, post it for everybody. They probably don't like that. You know, um, and it damages, you know, other outside influences damage this relationship. So be careful with that kind of energy. We do have water, fire, Taurus, Libra, air, um, water air aries pisces gemini um air another taurus could be sag cancer fire capricorn and earth okay so that is what i have for you all thank you so much for tuning in and take care of you mm, bye 
Hi Taurus Singles, let's get started. This is my second time recording this because <laughs> I didn't record myself the last time. It's just so crazy. Anyways, let's get started. Remember, it could, well, it could be very much be a prediction. Let's see what we have for Taurus Singles. It's not a personal reading, as you may know already. <laughs> we have honeymoon early stages Ooh, what is going on okay i feel of course new new energy coming through vitality we have happiness long term we have um babies Ooh, i lost oh what oh sorry about that <clears throat> i thought i lost something <laughs> Taurus. Let's see. Taurus spirit singles. I feel someone new. Okay. I feel like you're getting over somebody that you thought was someone real. You know, somebody turned out to be fake. You got catfished or something. They le leered you in or there's just definitely someone new coming through. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles. Someone long term. Okay, you're gonna go through the whole honeymoon phase, the early stages. We don't have a history, but we do have a future. That's what it says. We have catfished. Let's see, give me more on Taurus new singles. Somebody here, I feel like you're getting over some somebody that was just being very immature, even speaking to you, talking. Uh, they were just very immature with you. I feel like there was a lot of drama. You're getting over it, though. I feel like you, someone is, you're catching someone's eye. Someone new coming in, the fool. But you're going to be a little bit too, maybe trying to resist this, trying to n ignore this. But this person is willing to invest their time, energy in this to make you happy. You're either going to be their you're going to be the one that is there on their priority list. Yep. I'm telling you, this person is thinking long term. And it's going to catch you by surprise. Because I feel like this person is going to be persistent. Wanting to make you happy. They're, I feel like this is... You you don't even see this person as long term. But they are going to surprise you with the way that they are willing to put in the work willing to put in the energy time with you and you're gonna be kind of like okay uh, let's take things slow or backing away from this not knowing but this person is actually thinking about something long term we have it twice here i feel like you're gonna be getting over someone that was probably breadcrumbing you um, just leading you on and this new person is gonna be willing to even be like the fool like or pursuing you it doesn't even matter if you're gonna kind of resist them but they're gonna want to come towards you advice for taurus okay get out of the rut okay if things if these things don't feel enough for you and you want to create more excitement, try to think about what needs to happen and be part of the solution. So I feel like you're needing to um, be part of the solution, meaning getting out of that rut, doing something that you love. Who cares what you, well, who cares? You care, but <laughs> just getting over and uh, dealing with this kind of drama that you were involved with. So somebody immature okay but i do feel that there is going to be someone new willing to put in the work so get out of that space because i feel like you're going to be stuck for a while trying to get over something from the past or just stuck with this person uh, not wanting to move forward with this person but give it a try okay so that is what i have i do have earth scorpio air pisces aries uh could be a gemini earth signs Sag, air signs could be another Taurus. So the challenge is you, okay? <laughs> so you're gonna be a little challenged here. I feel so. So um, that is what I have. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll be back later. Take care of you. Mm, bye.